Peter Walsh, uh, you just finished the pole vault with a second place. Was it uh, a good competition for you? Yeah, very. Um, great wind. It was a nice tailwind for me, so it meant that I can get a lot more speed on the runway. Um, but yeah, it was a very good competition. Happy. It's, it's surprisingly hearing you say that uh, that you say great wind, because a lot of pole vaulters don't like wind. Yeah, well, as long as it's a tailwind for me, uh, it helps me to get more speed and move poles a lot easier and get away with it, really. Yeah, it was very good. The height of 470 is very close to your personal best and that at the end of the season. Yeah, I'm really, really happy with that to be honest. Like, I wanted to come here, eat cool my PB or get very close to it or even PB myself. Uh, it's been a very good season so I thought I can do it, yeah. And, uh, how is the spirit in your team? Oh, awesome, awesome. I had a lot of other teammates come over to the pole vault and they cheered me on and it was excellent, excellent, yeah. What was your best attempt today? Uh, 470. Um, went, for, when I went for 480. Um, just as soon as I started running it didn't feel right. Absolutely exhausted by the uh, heat I think, so yeah. How many years have you been doing pole vault? It's probably coming up to around four years. Um, I've had a couple of years where I've stayed around the same height, um, but this year it's it's um, coming on a lot better. I'm beginning to show that I can jump a lot higher and hopefully in the five meter pool really. How do you look at somebody like Renaud Lavillani? Oh, they're just, just someone to look up to really. They're a, a good role model for myself. Um, I think totally awesome and hopefully I can be as good as him one day. Uh, if you look at him, what is he doing very good? <laughs> Um, amazing speed down the runway, he's a really fast uh, pole vaulter. Um, I think he's probably the quickest pole vaulter out of the lot really. Um, and he's able to move massive poles and help him to uh, fly over bars really, so yeah. And what, what made that you decided to do pole vault? Um, I was very young and I, um, I saw some guy uh, go over and pole vault. And I was a bit of a daredevil. I wanted to do crazy things. Um, so instantly I wanted to do it. Uh, and I started around when I was like 15. So that was, that was the thing that I really wanted to do. It was exciting. Sometimes they say pole vaulters have to be a little bit crazy because those yeah. heights yeah, are really high. And you don't, you, well, if you are afraid of jumping high, then you cannot be a pole vaulter. Yeah, exactly. If, if you're afraid of heights, it's definitely not the sport for you. You have to be um, a daredevil, have to take risks and be not afraid, really. You just got to go with it. Are you never afraid? Um, I like to say I'm not, uh, but there are some moments where I think this is going to be really really hard so I have to sort of psych myself up and get rid of the fear really.